repeat the vows that we had taken 50 years ago. Uh, we recorded it at that time and I've transcribed them over into words and I'm going to get up there and repeat what we said 50 years ago as a reminder for uh, what started this all. So the nursing home uh, set this all up. They've been very, very gracious and kind in doing this. I know that uh, they have been, they've had some hard, difficult days recently, some heartbreaking days. And if this is, can be a little bit of encouragement to the, to the staff and, and residents here, then we're happy to do it. I, we're just a small part of it, but uh, I'm, again, I'm very, very happy that, that they uh, have gone to this effort uh, for Judy and I. We're just doing a lot to make sure our residents are happy, whatever we can do. And the community here in Wyoming County is just amazing. They've done so much for us just to keep us going and, and cheered up. And and so we come in and we do our jobs and we take care of the residents like they're our family. Well, we weren't sure what it was, whether it was just a basic, a last, you know, a last visitation for somebody who couldn't make it out of here or whether it was a kid that was just going stir crazy in there or whether it was somebody's for, you know, they're renewing their vows. It, we really didn't have a plan. We just said, hey, it's here. We're willing to help the community in any way, shape or form. And they took advantage of it. So we were happy to help and proud to be part of this moment. Learn to forgive and learn to forget. Uh, forgive and forget. Uh, we've gone through rough times. Everybody does in a marriage, but uh, we've worked our way through it. And uh, the good times clearly override the, the difficult times. But uh, uh, Lord has blessed us, and I'm happy for that. And uh, I, I wished I could give her a kiss, but... Uh, Maybe soon, I hope. <laughs>